Assalamu alaikum. This is your brother Majid Mahmoud recording for the daily reminder. Brothers and sisters, one of the best acts of worship the one who is fasting may ever do is to make dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Note how beautifully Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has the famous and amazing verse about dua in between the verses of fasting of Siyam to highlight the honor and status of making dua. Allahu Akbar. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in an authentic hadith, Thalathatun la turaddu da'watum. Three kinds of people when they make dua to Allah, their dua is surely not rejected. Number one, as-sa'imu hatta yuftar. The one who makes dua when they're about to break their fast. Number two, awal imamu al-adil. And the just ruler making dua. And number three, wa da'watu al-mazlum. And the dua of a person who has been oppressed and he Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and don't forget Sayyid sallallahu alayhi wa sallam he said and I love this hadith إِنَّ لِلصَّائِمِ عِنْدَ فِطْرِهِ لَدَعْوَةٌ مَا تُرَدْ The Prophet is stressing. He says basically the one who has been fasting and breaks their fast, that time when they make dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah will surely accept it and not reject it. What a golden opportunity that we don't want to miss. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala brothers and sisters appreciates it at the pinnacle and the climax of your hunger, of your weakness, of your tiredness and the food being presented here and there and you actually remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and you make dua to him during that time right around Adhan, Maghrib Adhan, you're about to begin your fast and you make dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah appreciates that and Allah tells you, you make dua that time, I will accept it and I will not reject it. Allahu Akbar. Some people may ask, brother, what time exactly should I make dua to get this like golden opportunity? The ulama, many of them have said there's room for it. So some have said you can make dua a few minutes before the adhan of Maghrib comes in. And some say you can make that dua after adhan and after your iftar, you break your fast, then you can make your dua and may Allah accept it whatever time suits you best. Brothers and sisters from the sunnah of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he used to make a specific dua during that time when he was about to break his fast. He used to say, The thirst is gone. وَبْتَلَّتِ الْعُرُوقَ And the veins are moist. وَثَبَتَ الْأَجْرُ إِن شَاءَ اللَّهِ And the reward is guaranteed by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Brothers and sisters, be optimistic like Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and follow the sunnah and make that dua and add whatever you wish. So don't be so distracted before Adhan time with all the food. Rather, seize the moment and make dua during that precious time. Take a few minutes aside, praise Allah and ask Allah for all your needs. And don't forget to hook it up, make dua for me and the whole day reminder team and so on. May Allah bless you. Feel free to like the video, click here to subscribe to our personal YouTube channel, but most important for you to click share on Twitter, Facebook, whatever social media, and send it to your friends and family. May Allah bless you. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa